Hey guys, I'm here with just a quick little video. I wanted to talk to you about another thing that I've added to my skincare. If you haven't seen my last skincare video that I did like maybe, hmm, I did one a year ago and then I did one maybe about six months ago. So I'll post both of those down below. Well, I have added something new, which is I've been seeing it all over Instagram, Facebook, TV, these uh, turmeric masks and um turmeric is supposed to help lighten up dark spots and do all of that uh good stuff to your face and so i wanted to try it <laughs> i wanted to see what um turmeric could do for my face now i was using kind of like a pumpkin turmeric but that one was kind of like um a wet consistency excuse my my pet i'm in the bathroom guys of course and this one that i'm going to try today well actually not today i actually been using this for a whole week I've been using this for a week because I wanted to test it out before I reviewed it and let you guys know how I really feel about it. So this is the Anai Aru. I hope I'm pronouncing that right, or Anai Aru Eye. It is a clay mask, it's turmeric. It's supposed to brighten, clarify, and repair. Okay, and I've actually been using this for a week. I said I'm gonna use it for a week before I come on here and talk about it. Um. I will leave all of the specs down below about it. In fact, you can tell I've been using it. I have the, it comes with a little brush. I need to clean it because the last time I used it, I just didn't have time to clean it. But this is a little brush that I actually use, that it comes with, that you use to spread on the mask. This is the mask. Nice packaging, nice and round. You get uh, 120 grams of product. This is, the consistency look at that it's so thick and creamy you can turn upside down shake it out nothing's gonna come out it is literally a mess and you're supposed to apply a thin layer on there but i'm not gonna lie i kind of caked it on a little bit <laughs> i just wanted to see if it was gonna like um harden up like i like how masks tighten up your face and then you take it off and it did it did it smells like fresh doesn't have really a any um smell so it basically says after cleansing apply a small amount evenly onto the face leave for 15 to 20 minutes to dry completely and then gently remove and rinse face with water so i've done that as you can see i've used quite a bit of product over this last week and um, i actually like it it really did i'm gonna let you see after you um just take a look at the video that i left but it really did brighten up on the first day i really don't have many expectations for facial products a lot of times takes a while to see the results, but this one really did clean my face and it really did leave it like a little bit brighter. So I like it. <laughs> so I'm actually gonna leave um, and let you guys just watch the video and I will talk to you guys in the next video. Be sure to check down below for all of the specs of this, where you can purchase it. I'll leave the link down below. And um, yeah, so again, thank you to them for sending me this mask that allowed me to even try it because I haven't really wanted to try turmeric and turmeric products for a while to see if it can help with some of these dark spots. I got my makeup now, but you'll see my natural face and you'll see the little dark spots that I have. It's not, it didn't lighten up my dark spots in one day. It's not bleaching cream, but it did brighten up my face and over time, it will help with those dark spots. So I'm gonna leave you guys to watch me put this mask on and I will talk to you guys in the next video. So here I am applying the face mask. And I applied it in my room because I was just relaxing and watching TV. So I was like, let me go ahead and try it. Like, as soon as I got it, I already didn't have on makeup. So I was like, let's do this now. Um, before I read that it should be a thin amount, <laughs> I had already started putting on, like, super thick amounts. Because I'm just like, I like that wrinkly effect it gives you when it tightens up on your face. I like when masks do that. So I'm just applying it very liberally. And um, the little brush is so good. And here I am just showing you afterward how the mask dried up. And now I'm gonna go ahead and start to remove it with some warm water. It removes very easily. It tightens up very nicely. The smell is not overpowering. I hate facial products that smell too strong. And this one was just like a fresh scent. It really didn't have like a super small, um, excuse me, super, um, you know, like a, a very dense smell it didn't have. Nothing overpowering. I've, I've had facial products that I can't even use because the smell is too much. So I'm just getting it out of my hair. I mean, when I tell y'all to put this on a lot, I did it a lot. 
but I mean, as you can see, it looks great. Like my face looks very clean. Um, it actually brightened up my skin. It's hard to tell exactly right here because of the way I have the camera angled and it's kind of dark right there, but I will move into the light so that you guys can see and pictures are way, Looking way better. Pretty good, guys. Yeah, and I was just telling you guys how it looks good and I have some dark spots to focus on. You see that spot over there on my cheek? I will come back and do another update after the product is 100% gone. So that's the end, guys. Thank you guys for watching. The link will be below. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video.